Sleepy Joe say law <laughs> enforcement. <laughs> Dark Knight Gang and it's that gang, gang. You already know what's up. Today I'm about to do a video, Donald Trump Savage Moments. Y'all requested it, you know I got y'all. Now, listen, before I hop into this, I am ignorant of politics. Not too much, I pay attention here and there. But, you know, my choice to be ignorant, I've already explained to you guys before. I'll explain again before everybody's in the comments. Um, I really feel like the banks, the corporations, the people that have most of the money, they lobby for the laws and the bills that they want to get passed, and they usually get passed, and it's always in their interest. If you look at the past, bro, it doesn't seem like the government has the interest of its people. It always seemed like it has the interest of big corporations, you know? And that's just my take on it. That's what I see, you know? A lot of people don't see that. They're blinded to that, but that's just my take on it. With that being said, are you guys going to vote? I want to know down in the comments. Are y'all going to vote? Me, am I going to vote? We'll see. Maybe, maybe not. I mean, we got Trump and we got horrible. We got horrible and we got disgusting. Like, I don't even know what to say. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, we're about to see Donald Trump's savage moments. He is the most savage president we've ever had in the history of presidents. You can't argue with that. No way would Obama would be calling his uh, opponent that he's running against any names. Donald Trump be over here like, Sleepy Joe, you can't do nothing. You ain't got no backbone. Like, I've never... Heard a president really come after people like that. It's crazy. But anyway, we're about to hop on into this, man. I'm ready to hop on into it. Yeah. Everybody have a good day. Go after all of your goals and dreams. You can achieve whatever you want to do in this life. Remember that. Let's go. What about this question <laughs> of reopenings and the fact well, that he wants right to here. shut down this country? Oh. And I want to keep it open. And we you did a great thing by shutting it, shut it down. Wait a minute, let, Joe. Let, let, let me shut you down for a second, Joe. Uh -huh. Just for one second. Uh huh. President Trump, you're holding large you rallies with crowds packed together, thousands of people. Outside. Outside, yes, sir. Agreed. Uh, Vice President Biden, you are holding much smaller uh, events with... Because nobody will show up. People Ooh. with... <laughs> What's true? With, nobody shows up to his okay. rallies. We have tremendous crowds, as you see, I mean, every... And, and literally on 24 hours notice. And Joe does the circles and has three people someplace. Okay. Uh, by the way, mm. I am. And the they're going to dominate you, Joe. You know head, that. Bro. I am the Democratic Party right now. The platform of the Not Democratic Party Harris. is what I, in fact, <laughs> approved of. What I approved of. A Harris administration together with Joe Biden. A Harris administration together with Joe Biden. Is it fair mean? to? Is it fair to say he blew it when, in when fact, it was came when there was record un low unemployment yeah. before COVID? Yeah, but, but because what he did, even before COVID, Trump manufacturing did do that, went though. in the hole. Manufacturing went in the hole. Excuse number me, one. Chris. Wait. Number two. Chris. Number three. They said they, it would they, take. They, no, you were number two. No. <laughs> you were at number two. What happened to number two, bro? <laughs> the president also is opposed to Roe v. Wade. That's on the ballot as well in the court, in the court. And so that's also at stake right now. And so the election is all You don't know it's begun. on the ballot. I, Why is it on the ballot? Because, because Why is it on the ballot? It's not on the ballot. Clearly, this person that made this video does not like Biden. It's on the ballot in the court. I don't think so. In the court. Well, There's nothing happening there. Donald, would you And you, you just don't know her me? view on Roe v. Wade. You I don't, don't know her know. view. Well, all right. Let's, all right. Let's talk. I would... We have ended this segment. We're going to move on to the second segment. That was really a pr productive segment, wasn't it? <laughs> Keep yapping, man. The people understand Ooh. you. <laughs> they 47 do. years, you've Je done nothing. They understand. Oh. All right. The second subject. Trump Over uh, hey, the last four years, you have promised to repeal and replace Obamacare, but you have never in these four years come up with a plan, a comprehensive plan yes, to I replace have. Obamacare. Of course I have. Well, I'll I got give rid of the individual finish, mandate. I'm going to give you Excuse an opportunity. Me. I got I rid of the individual work. mandate, which was that a big chunk of a That is absolutely a big thing. That was that, the worst I, I part of Obamacare. Sir, 
Chris, You're that was the worst part me. of Obama. Let me ask my question. Well, I'll, I'll ask Joe. I, 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 the individual I, mandate was the most unpopular Mr. aspect of Obamacare. I got rid of it. I'd like you and to, we will protect Mr. people. President, I'm the moderator of this Trump debate. Don't give up. I would like you to let me ask my question. And right. I guess I'm debating you, not him, but that's okay. I'm not surprised. We just got the support of 200, <laughs> mil, 250 military leaders and generals. Total support. Law enforcement, almost every law enforcement group in the United States. I have Florida, I have Texas, I have Ohio, I have every, excuse me, Portland. The sheriff just came out today and he said, I support President Trump. I don't think you have any law enforcement. You can't even say the word law enforcement because if you say those words, you're going to lose all of your radical left supporters. And Ooh. why aren't you saying those words, Joe? Why don't you say the words law I mean, because we don't Good the law enforcement because we would put out that fire in a up. half an hour, but they won't do it because they're run by radical left Democrats. If you look at Chicago, if you look at any place you want to look, Seattle, they heard we were coming in the following day and they put up their hands and we got back Seattle. Minneapolis, we got it back, Joe, because we believe in law and order, but you don't. The top 10 cities and just about the top 40 cities are run by Democrats and in many cases radical left and they've got you wrapped around their finger Joe to a point where you don't want to say anything about law and order mm. and I'll tell you what the people of this country mm. want and demand law and order and you're afraid to even say it mm. he doesn't have any I mean that's facts though Be but that's because yeah the two sides of the party yeah, I'll just speak on it really quick even though I don't pay too much attention to politics I don't pay that much attention at all but anyway yeah, man, because, I mean, people on the left, you know what I'm saying? Law enforcement be messing up. Let's keep it a stack. They be killing They be killing people. So defunding the police, I'm actually kind of here for it. I'm actually kind of here for it. But that's another topic. We, we came here to laugh at Donald Trump. Well, look, he has no law enforcement. That's not true. Almost that's nothing. Not, that, look, because, man, yeah. we want to kind of... Name one man. group that supports you. Name one group that came out and supported you. We need Go some ahead. reform when it comes to we the police time. department for sure. We don't have time to do no, anything. No, All right. All right. Name Folks. one law enforcement Folks. group that came well, I think, out and I think, supported Gentlemen, you. I think I'm going to, I'm going to take back the there moderator's are. role. I and, I want, and I want to get to Trump another subject, head, which is the bro. issue of protests in many cities that have turned violent in Portland, Oregon. Oh, I thought we were going to talk more about that. What you know about this? You don't know nothing about that Enter the Sandman. But I ain't getting copyrighted. I'm like 90% sure that's into the sand, man. I might be wrong, though. The has refused to do. I held Joe Biden accountable for his 47 years of lies, 47 years of betrayal, and 47 years of failure. Sheesh. I said, Sleepy Joe, name one <laughs> law enforcement group that supports you. And then Chris Wallace says, don't do that. That's not, can you believe this guy? I was debating two people last night. Trump. What are they going to do? You know, someday we're not going to be doing this anymore. I think Trump is going to win again. What are they going to do without Trump? What are they going to do? Oh, those poor people. Look at all of them. Whoa. I personally think he's going to win again, bro. What are they going to do when in 8, 12, maybe 16 years, I said, let's hang it up. Let's hang it up. Oh, there's a beauty. Here we go. Here we go. There's another beauty out there. I should there. love go a president in like 20 years. Ooh. I still want the president. I tell you the whole world. Did you see last better. night I said, say the words to law enforcement. Don't even say good or bad. Sleepy Joe, say law <laughs> enforcement. <laughs> he goes, no, I'd rather not. Say law enforcement, Sleepy Joe. <laughs> law enforcement with safety. No, no, no. It's law enforcement. He wouldn't say it, right? Then I said, name one group in the entire nation. I've got Minnesota now. I've got everybody. <laughs> Name one group in the entire nation from law enforcement that's supporting you. Well, 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 uh, uh, then Chris Wallace. Okay, let's go to the next question. He's in trouble. He's in trouble. Let me protect him for Fox. Joe <laughs> Biden says Antifa is just an idea. Nah, I've seen it. Well, when ideas I was out there. don't assault cops. Facts. I've seen it when I was out there protesting, bro. Antifa is a domestic terrorist organization. Yeah, I've seen it when I was out there, bro. After I put tariffs on foreign steel, 
The iron rage came roaring back. But the biggest thing I did was knock out his executive order. I've knocked out so much of the things that he did. He can't, can't like me too much. I would say he doesn't like me too much. Hey, did you see what happened with the FBI today? They caught them cold. Comey either has the worst memory in history. Did you see? I don't remember that. Did you spy on President Trump's campaign? Gee, I don't remember that. Did you go for a coup? Did you go for a coup? Uh, I don't, I don't remember. I don't <laughs> Did you see in New York today? A hundred thousand fraudulent ballots. They sent out a hundred thousand ballots. Wrong names, wrong addresses, wrong envelopes. Other than that, they did quite well. <laughs> All right, Donald Trump with some savage moments like always. But like I said, bro, Donald Trump is a savage. He is the most savage president we've obviously had throughout history. You know what I'm saying? Everybody else keeps it extremely uh, professional. Like Obama, extremely professional. You would have not heard Obama talking about his uh, opponent that he's running against calling him Sleepy Joe. Like, you know what I'm saying? But Trump don't give a f And I mess with Trump for that. He, he stands up for what he believes in. He talks his mess. And that's cool. You know, I might not agree on some things here and there. There's a lot of things I don't agree with. I'll be completely honest. But like I said, we got Trump and we got horrible. We got worse and worser. <laughs> worse is not a word. I know that. But anyway, I'm going to see y'all next time, bro. Let me know who y'all going to vote for if you're going to vote. If you're not, I understand. You know what I'm saying? You might have to take on it like me to where you're like, mm, you don't think the president really has that much power because once again, the banks and the corporations, they're paying for the laws that they want to get passed, and that's how it's been going. But I don't know. I don't know. Trump might try. I don't know. We're going to see. I personally think Trump is going to win, though. See you all next time.